Yo, yo, what up, y'all? Another day, another country. Just landed in Cancun, Mexico. Uh, I'm out here for Mastermind. I love Cancun, man. I've been out here a bunch of times, but it's like every time it's like brand new. No, thank you. <laughs> you know, it's like the nonstop hustle. They want to try and get me to rent a car, but <sighs> I had a very interesting day, man. Very interesting day getting to Cancun, but I'm glad I'm here. My bags ended up going to another city, having to get a last minute flight to that city, then having to get a last minute flight from that city to Cancun. But it's like about 10 something PM at night in Cancun. I should have been here since this morning, but hey, you know what? That's life, that's travel. That's, um, it is what it is. But about to hop in, hop in the transportation. Everybody's hustling, everybody's hustling. <laughs> no gracias. Everybody's hustling. But yeah, um, you know how it is when you get to a third world country, right? <laughs> Everybody's trying to get you to either rent a car or hop in their taxi. But I actually already got a ride set up via Viator. So I'm gonna jump in that vehicle. And I'll see you guys when I get to the resort. Brown scooping me up. Finally ready to go. Where are we going next, my brother? <laughs> there, welcome. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. Or vouchers, please. Uh, yeah, for sure. Guys, just pulling up to the hotel. Hilton all-inclusive. Finally, finally, finally. It's time to eat and drink. <laughs> You see you on Instagram, shout out from place to place to place. We want to know, are yeah. those live stories or are those reporter stories? It's a little dope. <laughs> a little dope. <good. laughs> <Yeah. laughs> Hilton, Cancun. So guys, it's a beautiful morning here on Cancun, Mexico. About to walk inside this resort because I'm feeling good. I want to give y'all just a, a, a view of how this property looks and also, you know, some of my peeps as we uh, get ready to hit the strip, right? So let me show y'all around. Walking through okay. the lobby. You got all that down there. It's a nice property, all inclusive. You already know what all inclusive means. All you can eat, all you can drink, all you can drink, and all you can drink. So there's a few restaurants here. You already know they got the, the buffet restaurants. Uh, it's like this restaurant is closed. Then you open for dinner. Let me show you the pool area. It's a kiddie pool over here to the left. Also the adult pool to the right. Let's see, how can I get down here? God, we have a couple pools. Um, let's see, how do I get down here? Oh, I guess I can walk down here. It's a little hot, I ain't gonna lie to y'all. But guess what? I always I always prefer hot than cold, for sure, for sure. Then you got the kids over here. Then you got the adults over here. There's two pools. You know what's better than one pool? Two pools. Oh, well, I guess it's one big pool. Yeah, there's another pool. I know there's another pool somewhere. Maybe it's down there, but I don't know. Y'all can check it out. More bars, people enjoying themselves. Beautiful day in Cancun. I gotta tell y'all though, right? If there's one thing I am pretty surprised about, it's how brown, how brown the water is, right? Like I'm gonna show y'all. Like it just does not. The water, you know, it's, it's, it is not turquoise <laughs> at all. 
Um, I don't know. It's because of the seaweed. I know that's that's the big thing in Tulum. There's a lot of seaweed in the water. Um, but can't be too mad, right? So, so, so Mexico. I actually want to show you how the water and how unappealing it is. <laughs> Good vibes, nonetheless. People out here tanning. Boats pulling up and pulling out for excursions. Guys, look at this water. Look at this water. How you doing? This is... This is not that appealing. It's just not... <laughs> it doesn't excite me to go in, no. But uh, you can see the property from this angle. And it's an ocean front. Brown water ocean front. Uh, let me walk this way. I'm gonna go in for a little lunch. Honestly, not that hungry, but um, had a pretty decent sized breakfast. But we're about to leave the property to go to the strip. And you know what? The, the food is free here because it's all inclusive. And I said, you know, why not get a little bite to eat here? while well, it's free. <laughs> so that way I got I got the, the gas tank slightly full, right? And then, uh, let me zoom this here, Zah. I feel like this little, there we go. Yeah, I feel like this is just really close. Yeah, let me back this up. Yeah, let me fill the gas tank up so that way, uh, you know, as I'm out and about, I don't, I don't get too hungry, you know? So you, you gotta maximize your dollars when you got all inclusive. You know, you gotta maximize your dollars. And you know, typically at all inclusive, oh, that's it. The, the, the second pool's on that side. Got it. Um, typically at all inclusive, like the the food isn't that good, but the food's been pretty decent so far. We got a little food stop right here. All right, guys. So I got my plate. All right, I'm gonna take my food inside. find my friends, wherever they are. Oh, it looks like it's down here. Oh, it feels so good in here. It is like scorching hot. But, um, hola. Yeah, guys. You know, gonna eat up, hit the strip. Um, I'm here for a mastermind, just to remind y'all again. And the group that I'm with, they, they went on some excursions this morning. And, you know, I just, I just wasn't for it. <laughs> I've been to Cancun so many times and I've just done these, uh, I've done those particular excursions, like the whole zip lining and ATV and things of that nature. So I had to skip out on it. So I just really want to relax. You know, as you guys know, uh, maybe you don't know, but just came back from Europe did about like five or so countries in like like eight or nine days so it's like i just want to chill you know so take it easy and uh just vibe out right look at these guys right here the money makers Hi. what's up what's up what's up i just want to be as rich as these guys you know? <laughs> <laughs> all right y'all let's eat all right y'all so we just hit the main strip we're liking this Thank you. Shopping mall area. My guy Dion right here. Business credit. What's going on? King. Goat. All right, we just vibing, man. Just another day. Just another day. Just man. another day. It's a regular day. You know, it's a beautiful day in the neighborhood. So we just seeing what's up out here. What you want when you want. It's a lifestyle, man. Hey, because what's today? Today's Thursday? It's, I think, yeah, you I know? think, yeah. Thursday. Thursday, yeah. Chrissy's birthday is in seven days. What is that thing? Damn, some, some smells good. Get a fish pedigree. How y'all feeling? 
scared. Y'all excited? I'm excited. So, so check out the cool fish. Cool the lotion in the skin. Check out the that fish. That one is toxic for the fish. What they don't know is these fish are about to go all in on their feet. <laughs> you took video? Oh my God. All in. It's bad. Every little bit of dead skin y'all have is about to be gone. That's a good thing. It is. It is That's good. That's a really good thing. And they're hungry. <laughs> Tell us if they're hungry. <laughs> They're gonna enjoy it. I did this um, for the first time in Thailand several years ago, so um, I wanted them to experience it. So, so I want y'all to see their reaction. Okay. Okay. Three, two, <laughs> and one. It's time to do. Slowly, slowly. Uh. <laughs> Oh, that's oh, interesting. Oh, wow. It hurts. It don't hurt. It's it interesting. Wow. I'm scared. I don't like being tickled. Oh my god. How does it feel? Bro, it feels. It's like. Oh my god. It's like getting tickled, bro. It's it's kind of a weird feeling. Oh my god. Like that's crazy, yo. After two minutes, you lost it. I promise. Oh, I'm wow. scared, baby. Let me help you. And you have fun too. Come to the Wow. Pancho, Are you holding your feet up? Just, look yeah. at that, they ready, they ready. <laughs> they ready. Put it in there. Yeah. That's crazy, it's yo. Ready for you. It feel like, uh, I don't if know. If you have good. a lot of feet, that's a good sign. Uh, I'm right, about to have a quick, quick drink, quick bite to eat. We're here making some authentic tacos. <laughs> Hola. <laughs> Alright, great morning, great morning people. Another day in paradise. Um waking up feeling good, thinking good, about to head downstairs. It's day one of the masterminds. So the first day was check-in, then the next day, um, it was kind of like a bonding experience, you know, there was excursions and things of that nature. And it was kind of a day, day just kind of chill. Um, today is where the actual mastermind starts. So now I'm heading downstairs, about to go check in and grab some breakfast. All right. Another beautiful day on the resort. Grab me some breakfast. Matter of fact, first, let me register for the event first. You know, I gotta tell you, man, you know, there's nothing more empower there's nothing more important. Well, there's a few things more important, like believing in God and and just being a good person, right? But what I'll say is investing in yourself is probably one of the most key things that you can do in your life because that is when you'll get the most ultimate return, right? Investing in yourself. And I think the reality is a lot of people, they just don't invest in themselves enough. Whether they feel like it's not worth it. Um, they don't they don't they don't believe in themselves enough, but either way Like let me show you <clears throat> This is my guy Neil He's the one that's Hosting this here mastermind um, But you got to invest in yourself man, and, and you always got to be in student mode, right? You always got to be learning new skills like learning how to get to the next level Right, sharpening your tools, right? Never being complacent, never feeling like you arrived, right? You just have to understand, like, this life is always changing, right? There's evolution constantly in play. And the thing is, the skills that you have now, the knowledge that you have now, may not be enough to get you to the next level later on, right? So, that's why you always wanna keep growing. That's always why, that's always why you wanna keep learning and you wanna meet new people, right? Build new relationships because relationships is everything, right? Matter of fact, relationships might be more important than uh, than income. Found it, my guy Neo, it's about to go down. Oh, look, look at this, boom baby. Guys, 
so it is post mastermind about to get some dinner um i'm actually really not that hungry but you know it's an all inclusive so it's like there's always an opportunity to eat but I'm about to go to this mexican restaurant it's called maxel i'm gonna show you how it looks this one's called maxel i think this one's called maxel but here we go cool cool restaurant Check it out, ocean front. I actually already have my food here. <laughs> That's a uh, snapper and vegetables, aka vegetables, right? Ugh. Gonna give it a whirl. Looks like Chrissy opted to get some too with her ceviche. All right, so about to give it a whirl. Well, I seen it. Um, seen some I had. I was um, Marcus and Rosino's in here. Gonna give this a whirl, guys. See how it is. Oh, let me record for the gram. I forgot. Really quick. All right, so let's give it a try. How is it? Matter of fact, don't tell me. Let me try first. <laughs> I like it. That's good. What you think? I like it. Snapper's good money to me. Chrissy hasn't told me how she thought, but she's not easily impressed. <laughs> Gonna continue and stay tuned. <laughs> I forgot, I didn't even get a chance to show y'all the room, so let me have y'all check it out. It's a pretty dope room. It's a little, it ain't the, really the cleans right now, but I'm gonna show y'all. It's really spacious. Check it out, bathroom, all right? Pretty spacious, pretty spacious. Check it all out. Here's my favorite part though. Right. Yeah. Hold up, hold up. Okay. How do I open this thing? Oh. You don't gotta be that smart though. <laughs> the wraparound balcony. Now, I ain't gonna lie, like the water is definitely not that nice, but yeah, the balcony wraps around. Definitely cool, really spacious. I don't know what's going on in Cancun and Saloon, man. See, y'all see that water? Yeah, not that cool, but <laughs> either way, it's still cool. Or if you if you look all the way out there, though, definitely does get more blue and aqua. But just wanted to have y'all see the room because I always let me zoom this out. Got a little too close. Yeah, I just want y'all to see the room because um, you know, every every time I travel somewhere. And stayed a lot, you know, different properties. I always give y'all like a tour or something, so I figured why not let me show y'all around this spot, right? So I just ran up my ran up to the room to, to grab a hoodie because it's actually really cold inside the conference room. So I'll see y'all shortly. We toasted to taking immediate action on the new information, new partners, new lifestyle, right? Perfect action. In perfect, In perfect action. action. There we go. Cheers, 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 cheers. Cheers, cheers, cheers. Cheers, cheers, cheers. 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 Seven figures. Seven figures. Seven figures only. Seven figures. Hey. Hey. Oh. Let's go. Yes, sir. So guys, so pretty much it's the pretty much the ending of the mastermind. We're on the way to the I guess the grand finale. It's like a pretty much the ending of the mastermind, like kind of like a dinner party or whatever, just mixer. Well, not mixer. What would you call it? It's dinner. Yeah, dinner. Bon voyage dinner. But as we were getting ready to leave out, Hilton um, pretty much showed love with some wine and some strawberries. 
Chrissy ate all the chocolate strawberries. And um, they were pretty much just helping us celebrate, right, our soon to be two year anniversary, which is pretty awesome with this beautiful young queen. I love you. I love you too. So, headed down to the event as we sip on some wine. See you shortly. Wow. Guys, this is the event here. Pretty cool. mastermind so understand this y'all I mean I feel like time and time and time again I come on here 
and I talk about how important it is to invest in yourself, invest in yourself, go to conferences, go to masterminds, find mentors, constantly put yourself in the right environments to build relationships, but also to grow your mindset. So that way you're just never like, just settling. You're not settling, you're not settling with who you are, your current level of skill sets and potential. You're constantly growing, you're constantly level up, and you're also constantly building a circle of influence, right? Which is absolutely key. Um, right now I'm looking out for the gate in terms of where, my, where I'm flying out of. But just understand this, man. A lot of people, they kind of just stay in their own neighborhood, stay, stay in their own comfort zone, but you got to go to grow. Sometimes that event or that mastermind or that networking event is going to be outside your neighborhood, outside your city, outside your state, even outside your country. And who cares? If that's where you need to be, get up, hop in a car, get on the flight, make the sacrifice, get on the bus, train, whatever, do whatever it takes to get in the room and make it happen. That's the key to winning, is doing all you can do to get to where exactly you want to go. So, I'm gonna look for this fight and I'm gonna see you in a second.